So I was 14 years old when I came out to my Filipino Catholic parents. Stop singing, stop dancing, and stop sewing. I'm now living my authentic life and self. My entire world is so much better. There is this notion of what it means to be LGBTQ plus IA, and there is a notion of what it means to be Muslim. Being an out politician as a Muslim is an act of bravery. When we have role models like you, that people can look and say, you can be anything you want to be. God says I am fearfully and wonderfully made. This ignorance of like, no, I have to have a word or a box or a category or a label to put you in. Why do any of these things matter? unless you're trying to like limit resources from me. I think faith is the hardest thing that queer people deal with um, because so many of us grew up, you know, in the church and came out later in life. Telling our stories through our personal narratives and showing ourselves through photographs humanizes who we are for people who don't understand us. And everyone's story is so vital. I can fade into the background and not be perceived. It is difficult to see how that is not the case for someone that I care about so deeply. I've seen the awareness grow. I've seen the visibility grow. There is a place for us and there's hope for us. We get married, we have kids, um, we have real jobs to be with black queer clergy. We may not share a theology, but we share our experiences being in this country, in this society. I'm an openly gay Filipino comedian and for minorities and for, in some states you can't even talk about being gay. I mean, it sounds crazy. I mean, I feel like, what, is this 1950? It's easier to be openly gay than openly vegan. <laughs> I know that each and every one of us, those that have intersectional identities every day, we're putting in the work to create this world that we know is possible.